the, the things that make the St. Noble College education great are going to be there this fall. Things are going to look and feel different on campus, but the excellent educational experience and living in community remain front and center. We believe in what we're doing. Current students already know what they're missing at St. Norbert College, the beauty of campus, their friends, the food, and more. Incoming freshmen and their parents will soon find out why everyone calls St. Norbert home. On August 24th, classes are scheduled to resume on campus. But because of the global pandemic, much is going to be asked of each and every person. It's important to stay at home if you're sick or show symptoms. You'll be hearing a lot about the three W's recommended by the Wisconsin Department of Health Services when you return to campus. And each W is critical to the health and safety of the St. Norbert community. The first W is wash your hands. Not only, of course, do we have, um, you know, the, the soap and water and paper towel, but we are going to have hand sanitizer all across campus to make it a little easier for everyone to practice strict hand washing. Next is wearing a mask inside the classroom and outdoors, except of course in your personal living quarters. You will see signage in and around campus noting that face masks are required for everyone. If you don't have a mask, the college will provide you with one. It's very important that everyone on campus, visitors, students, staff and faculty all wear a mask. The final W is watch your distance. Physical distancing works and so we just need to keep our circle small and watch our distance. More than six feet from another person when possible. Many of the common shared spaces will look a bit different when you arrive on campus. You'll see that glass shields have been installed in high traffic office areas, much like you see in stores. The facilities department has placed distance stickers six feet apart and signs all over campus printed by St. Albert College's Digital Print Center located in the lower level of Michaels Commons. Classrooms have been arranged differently as well, taking into account the watching your distance. St. Norbert went to great lengths to make sure classrooms will be safe for students and faculty. Most courses will be in-person courses with the physical distancing in place. Um, a few courses, around a handful, will be completely online. In addition to those in-person courses, there will be flexibility to allow for hybrid. So maybe a faculty member or a student in the class is sick and unable to attend class one day, that hybrid modality will allow the educational experience to still continue. Bonds Racky noted that all the services students are entitled to will continue, such as meeting with your faculty advisor, the registrar's office, or academic support services. You simply reach out to those individuals and schedule a virtual or in-person appointment. Another important part of the St. Norbert student experience is athletics. Right now, the Midwest Conference has committed to offering sponsoring sports. We're going to be working with a divisional play only in the conference. We're going to be uh, eliminating uh, overnight travel to the extent that we can uh, and taking every precaution we can to uh, make sure that the athletes are safe and that they're able to compete. Uh, and it'll be a, a different kind of experience. We're going to phase in athletics uh, so students will, will do everything they can to make sure that they're safe when they get here. There are some key dates you'll need to remember for move-in day, which is fast approaching. On August 17th, 18th, and 19th, upperclassmen can move in, but you must schedule an appointment. Upperclassmen can also move in on Friday, August 21st. August 20th is reserved for first-year students only. We've decided that we can safely, with lots of precautions in place, uh, have two students per room. Living on campus is such an important part of our educational philosophy, our student experience, that we're really proud of the fact that we can offer that in, in as safe a way as possible. There have been many decisions made, and there are more to come. But the decisions are purposeful and intentional, they're data-driven, they're informed by science and our understanding of this pandemic, and our desire to be together uh, as a community again. We look forward to seeing you at St. Norbert College in August. I'm Mike Counter for St. Norbert College.